is Ezekiel Akeloye David. I am a teacher by profession, and by the grace of God, by calling, I am a pastor. Uh, I am the proprietor of Christ Heritage Nostrum Primary School that is located in Abeokuta, Ogun State, Nigeria. By the grace of God, I have a lot of experience since I started this school. I discovered it's not uh, an easy thing to run a school because you are dealing with lives, you are building lives, you are molding lives, you are molding future leaders, preparing future leaders. And for you to be able to do that uh, successfully, you need to be a focused person. You need to be prayerful. You need to be somebody who is determined, who is focused, not being distracted by uh, ASAs of people here and there. And by the grace of God, and because the Lord has been with, with us in this uh, uh, profession, in the running of the school, we have been able to uh, raise leaders of tomorrow. Several of our uh, products have been masters in one profession or the other. Some of them are actually still in higher institutions. Some of them are in the secondary school. But by and large, I want to believe God has helped us and that we have been able to make a lot of uh, successful records. Our vision and mission, our philosophy as a school owner is to be able to raise a people who will be able to stand on their own anywhere they find themselves in the world. Particularly in this age in which there is scarcity of job. There's no job anywhere today, not only in Nigeria, although it is more prominent in Nigeria, more prevalent in Nigeria, but all over the world today, except you are a master of your own self, except you develop yourself to become an employer of uh, labor, you may find it difficult to be able to live uh, conveniently uh, in Nigeria or anywhere in the world. And that's the reason why what we are trying to do is to be able to raise a people who will be able to stand on their own Apart from the Western education we give to people, we also develop people morally. We train people to know the Lord so that they be able to live their lives the way it should be lived. Particularly in this age, this era of moral decadence in which children are turning to be problem for the country. We believe that a child that you face to train very well is going to become a, a stone in the flesh of the family, stone in the flesh, a turn in the flesh of the country. And that's the reason why we don't take the spiritual aspect of our training lightly. We try as much as possible to teach people to know the Lord, to teach them to know that without God, they cannot uh, attain any goal. And uh, we try to instill the fear of God in the lives of our uh, students, our pupils. And so far, God has been helping us. In fact, we have some uh, days that we have uh, separated apart to praise God and to train the people, the children, the way of the Lord. And our parents too has been so uh, supportive in this area. Though uh, our school is a Christian school, but we have so many children from other religion, Muslim, uh, idolatrous uh, families, they send their children to our school, despite the fact that they know that we are a Christian school, but they know that we are not going to mislead their children. Our school is located in Isalejion, Itoku area in Abeokuta, Ogun State. This is one of the remote areas when we are talking about uh, the location. But despite that, we have many of our children who come from other areas that are 
far away from uh, Isa Legion. And uh, at the same time, we have many of our children that are coming from Isa, especially uh, majority of our, children, of, our, of our pupils, they come from Itoku because their parents do trade in Itoku market. And because of that, majority of our uh, students, our pupils, the pupils of our school are uh, from Itoku. Although their parents live in far away places, but once they are coming to their shop or their, uh, the place of uh, their trade, they drop their children with us in the school. And it makes it easier for them to go about their business because they know uh, their children are safe with us because we have enough to take care of their children. We have a lot of workers, the caretakers. We have the, the school maintenance, apart from our teaching staff. In the area of our specialization, our school is not just a normal educational school that runs a, a Western education teaching alone, but um, spiritual aspect of training has made our school to stand out because we make sure that these children are nurtured in the way of the Lord. They are trained in the way of the Lord so that whenever, wherever they find themselves anywhere in the world, they be able to stand for God. We begin to, we try as much as possible to catch them young, to catch them young from their childhood. We catch them up from childhood so that they be able to stand for God. And when it is time for them to make decisions, they make their decision for God. They will not develop, they will not grow to become rebels. They will not grow to become thieves. They will not grow to become killers, murderers, like it is happening all over the world today. And that is the reason why we so much love that aspect. And that is one of the things that stands our uh, our school out. Apart from that, our products have been very, very good, very, very successful. Whenever we reel out uh, outgoing pupils that are going to secondary school, they, they, they go and sit for a common entrance exam and they make it. They make it not because we go we go and use any any uh, other ways, any go and cut corner to help them, but make, we make sure that we nurture them, we prepare them, we train them, we coach them, we give them extra coaching so that they be able to face the exam and they be able to pass the exams very well. Some parents came to me in the past to come and ask me whether I should go and uh, liaise with the Ministry of Education or with the examination body so that their children will be passing their exam. I said, I don't do it. I want the children to be able to boast anywhere that whatever they score in their exam is their handwork. And that we have been doing.